get about maybe a half inch into the cigar, and then you cut from there. Uh, some people like to knock off the end. Some people you know, tap a little bit. It doesn't really matter. Java. That was by Drew Estate. That was my thing. So I like dark, robust cigars, but it has a flavor to it. And then. <clears throat> As I started to get more and more comfortable, I am talking to different people and asking them what they smoke and what kind of cigar it was. Right now, my favorite smoke is the Ash. You know, don't be intimidated to come in the lounge. People usually walk by. They stop a little like it's a zoo or something. Like they scared to death to go in there. Like, oh, they are so interested. They never step aside. This was regular people. You don't know who the doctor, who the politician, who the janitor. You know, everybody there have a cigar. In New York, you know, they clamp down on smoking and a lot of regulations that push cigar prices along with tobacco prices up. So uh, you got the um, Cigar Ranks of America, CRA, for fighting for cigar smokers to try to get those tobacco prices to push to a, a level for premium cigars. A good cigar, you don't have to spend a lot of money. You get a good cigar for about $7. And you know, all the way up to $34. Uh, you want to use a torch light. You don't want to use book matches or big lighters. Okay? It sucks up the fuel. Like those lighters, those, those lighters, big lighters spit out a lot of fuel. Every three seconds, like it's a cigarette. You want the ash to get kind of long, that uses it as a filter.